Hey guys, I've got a quick one for you today. It's another exposed module. This one is called Swipe Back. It is of course available in the exposed installer. And what this does is it essentially adds a global swipe back gesture to your Android phone or tablet. And I find this works especially well if you use the Pi controls like I do. You can see I don't have the on-screen navigation buttons here. So to normally press back, I'd have to bring up Pi and press the back key. That's not too much of a problem, but I do think Swipe Back handles it a little bit more elegantly and I think it's a little bit faster as well. So to use this gesture, you just swipe from the left-hand side to the right hand side just pull it across and that's it you've gone back you can of course go all the way back through the applications you have open all the way back to your launcher so it works very smoothly and it's very elegant if you open up Twitter for example you could go into a tweet and instead of using the Pi controls to go back to the main Twitter page you could just pull from the left hand side and it's as quick and easy as that and of course if you do it again you're gonna go back to your home screen now I'm sure a lot of you are asking the question what happens when you open up an application that has a pull out nav drawer on the left hand side will there be a conflict now we know Gmail has one of those so if we try it you'll see I want to pull out this uh, this nav drawer right here I can't because there is a conflict, it now takes me back using that gesture. There is a way around that though, if we dive into the settings and open up the UI for swipe back, it actually allows you to configure this per application. So if we swipe down to Gmail, it actually allows you to completely turn off the swipe back gesture. It also allows you to change the swipe edge, so if you know a nav drawer is on the left hand side, you can actually change the swipe back gesture to either the right or the bottom hand side you can change the edge size and you can also change the swipe sensitivity so there is a way around that if we turn that off now you'll see that if we uh, go back to the home screen and we go into Gmail you'll now see that it doesn't use that swipe back gesture and now I can easily pull out that nav drawer so there's no problems there you can configure it per application it's a pretty cool module definitely give it a shot if you haven't yet let me know what you guys think peace out